an exciting year for consumer drone market. We now have serious contenders for the high-end drone market and technologies that keep getting better, 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 better and better. <laughs> for me in 2020, it is time for me to upgrade into high-end consumer drone. Since I don't have actual high-end drone as yet, so I'm gonna keep this video short and sweet. So let's start right now. So you guys can see there are three drones that I'm going to compare. Autel Evo 2 that has just been announced but actual delivery date is not yet confirmed and Skydio 2 which has been very popular but is only available in North American market. Mavic 2 which had sort of been like the king of the high-end consumer level drone and we have not yet heard about Mavic 3 yet. Although it should be this year right? So I'm gonna go through the key points for these drones and the first is of course the camera. Otel Evo 2, it does have three different variations. The standard is 8K, yes, with half inch sensor. The 6K Pro version, the resolution is 6K, but with one inch sensor and an adjustable aperture of f2.8 to f11. And the other variation is more for like commercial industrial use, it is the AK camera with thermal sensor. So you guys can see that latest EVO 2 has far more superior camera than other competitors. I mean Mavic 2 does have one inch sensor, but the resolution ends at 4K. Skydio 2 does offer 4K 60 frames per second. With drone photography, with EVO 2 you can enjoy 48 megapixel. Even bitrate EVO 2 offers 120 Mbps. Wow. So the latest hot topic in the drone market is the flight time. In CES 2020, we've even seen V-Copter Falcon, which can apparently fly up to 50 minutes. So what about all these high-end drones that I'm comparing? Evo 2 does have 7,100 mAh, which means 40 minutes of flight time. So far I can see Autel is really killing it. So with all those battery time, how about the range? Autel Evo offers 9 kilometers, whereas Mavic 2 comes a little bit behind Autel, whereas Skydio 2 the range is significantly weaker. But arguably the most important aspect about the drone is the price. And all these technologies don't come that cheap. And these are the price. Either two, the price haven't been released. Many guess that it's around 1500. So all these high-end drones, they come sort of 1500 plus minus in that range. And for that, for some drones, you get eight gigabyte storage and Skydio 2, you don't. And other key features are as follows. You guys can screenshot this screen. So what do you guys think? So I really want to applaud Autel. Très bien, excellent. Because I think Autel has really brought up the game in high-end drone market. I mean, we may not need a K resolution as yet, but that is where the technology is going. So DJI, you guys should bring something good on the table with Mavic 3. I'm really waiting for that. So meanwhile, I'll keep a watch out and also keep practicing my drone skills, editing skills. So please don't forget to subscribe and like this video and see you.